Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to chat quite a bit about, well not quite a bit, it's actually I think I'm going to be a very short message today because it's pretty punchy and it's to the point, um, but I get asked this a lot. Last week I was at um, Bidvest Bank doing a talk to all the women there for Women's Day around how to build your confidence. And um, one of the questions that I got asked by one of the ladies there was how would, what advice would I give in terms of how to have a work-life balance? And I said to her, for me, it quite simply is what feels right. Now, I've been talking a lot about this of late on my videos about what feels right. But it really is about that. You can't look at your boss and say, I need a work-life balance because you're not, you don't feel like you've got it. Because it's not their job to give you that. It's their job to give you a job and to give you work. And hopefully the work that you're doing is making you happy. But if something in life is something that you enjoy and you want to do, along with the work part that you're doing, that's where the balance comes. You need to be, make sure you're doing enough work stuff and enough life stuff that feels good and feels right. Now, I mean, the biggest thing to consider is this idea of saying no to things that you don't want to do and don't feel right. Now, I mean, I'm not talking about if part of your job description is you have to do a certain task and you hate it and you should tell people you don't want to do it. Um, because part of accepting your job is to accept the totality of it and everything that goes with it. Um, but overall, you need to be hopefully working in an environment that you enjoy and you're doing stuff that you like and make you, makes you passionate. There will always be a few things that we don't like in our jobs. Um, it's completely natural. But on the majority, or the uh, overall, you need to have um, a place where you go that you're really enjoying. So whatever your, your overall task is at work, it needs to feel right for you. And it feels, needs to feel that you're doing the right thing by yourself and by your soul. But in the same respect, life requires the same from you. And only you can put that stuff into your life. And that's where I go back to if there's something that you really, really enjoy and something that you love doing, um, whether it's exercise in the morning or going for a coffee with your friends every single day after work or whatever it is, right? Riding your bike or it doesn't matter, right? Having your nails done, whatever it is, if that's something that you enjoy, you have to make sure you make time for it because as soon as you start doing all the stuff in life that you love, and then the work stuff that is an overall picture for you, you have a balance. And that's work-life balance. It needs to feel right inside that your life is aligned and working for you. And if it's not, the balance is out because you're not putting the balance in. Nobody can do the balance for you, only you can. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to chat about today because I do get asked it quite a bit and um, it's all up to you. But then again, I mean, I say this all the time, your life and your happiness is all up to you. How are you going to approach things and what are you going to do about life or work or whatever? <laughs> um, so yeah, I hope that was a good enough message, took something out of it today. If it was, give me a thumbs up. Um, and if you haven't hit subscribe, please hit subscribe now. I hope you have a great day um, and make sure you're feeling balanced and aligned.